What's up, people? It's time for Dishonored. Welcome back to another video. Last time we left off here uh, at the Hound's Pit. Uh, we came over here by boat and met up with this guy. I don't know. But um, they're here to help, I think. So let's, uh, let's get right into it. I expect they're hard at work in there. Let's join them. <clears throat> They'll help you get whoever really killed the Empress. Alrighty. I'm sure the Admiral was anxious to meet you. It wasn't easy getting you here. No, it was not. But you didn't really do anything. Well, you you did get me out of prison. I wouldn't hang about if I were you. From what I understand, time's getting short. So it's starting at last, Admiral. We've found our man. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock, a true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with you. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. All right. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times. But his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Got it. And where am I supposed to go now? Workshop near the dock. Oh, yes. Here. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work for you... I will create the tools of a master assassin. Is that my mask? No! This cannot happen now. The tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Yay! Alright, that is my mask indeed. Let me get the whale oil. Hello? This is... no? Is there any coin around here I can steal? Uh, no, I don't want to read that. No, I don't want to read that either. You guys can pause the video if you want to read those, just in case. The Academy teaches that absurd idea that the energy in whale oil arises from the need to maintain life functions at extreme ocean depths. The pressure in the cold are too much to endure without it. I speculate that a human being might, by a process of adaptation, produce high energy humors in the body. I could build a tank that would slowly increase pressure on a subject over a long period of time and then observe years if need be. Are you still alive? The formulation of energetic yeah. substances. My dispenser will provide more. Surely the Empress would be able to furnish me with facilities subject to I just wanted to set it down. Can I just um set this down without exploding? Okay, good. I wanna fill it up just in case uh, he needs more. Just be nice. <clears throat> you have a lot of whale oil it seems, so I don't have to worry much. Perfect. Now plug it in. There you go. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see? The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just oh, look at that. hold still, the fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Send the lens out of the line. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. 
scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Black market, he says. Tell me what I can make for you. Let's have a look. Hmm. Upgrades. So crossbow, swords, pistols, masks. Um, huh, mask upgrade. Allowed you to magnify your view. Press left alt. Huh. That might be good. Makes the sword more effective when locking blades and pushing against an enemy. Let's just buy this for now. Purchase. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Got it. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. Got it. I want to see if there's coins hiding around here. Do you have coins? Ooh. All right, if you guys want to read that, it's there. Alright, well I just took his map and uh, got coins from it. Uh, I don't really feel like reading most of this stuff. What is he looking at? Alright, I'll be back after I look for some coin. The only way to help them, City Watch. They will be taken to the flood. I did some oh, go on. Parvo's chambers. Can I sleep here? Ah, yes, I can. I uh, did parkour up to my home. Oops. My furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaint. Okay, man, you don't have to come so close. The others have no idea. Well, I'll begin again tomorrow. Don't look at me like that. Don't give me that glare, what the? Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days, but you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. All right, well, I'm just gonna, goodbye, man. The hell? What the fuck? I just saw a ghost. Ah! Never mind, I didn't. Ow. Attention, oh my. citizens of Dunwall. Peekaboo. <laughs> Alright, guys, so I've been adventuring a lot. You saw probably some clips here and there of some stuff that happened. But, um, I ended up getting. A lot of coin I had like around 300 and now I have 1022 so I got lots and lots of coin and we're gonna continue the story now all right well um, we sleep we uh, we sleep now that was weird uh, go to sleep all right I'm awake is a night what the hell this was open before must be night out maybe oh well this isn't strange um i thought it was raining or something i did really not expect um uh it to just be Hello. Weird. Hello, Your sir. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? It has. The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter, Emily, is lost somewhere in the city. And you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. Well, that's nice. I am the outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world. Great forces that we call magic. And now... These forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power. My gift to you. Well, thank you. Come find me. 
Okay. Press right mouse button to execute a fast and stealthy forward dash through the world. You can also use it to move upward, but the distance is reduced aiming at ledges. It will allow you to blink forward and climb up. Hold it to target your destination with precision. A blue sphere indicate, indic eh. indicates that you should reach your destination. A blue arrow indicates that you will climb up when you you reach your destination. Okay. Yay. And I have mana. Okay, let's see if I have any. Is there any coin in this world? Probably not, but I'm still going to look for it. Pretty cool. Um, Alright, this is the dead entrance. You cannot save her. 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 Okay, I get the, get the point. Ooh. Remedy. Alright. Ah! Ah! Let's try that again. I want to have the arrow pop up. Ooh, okay. Ah! Ah! Okay. That's not what I meant to do. I did not know I could just teleport into a random air. I don't think I can make it there. Huh. Is this something that's happening right now? Corvo, I'm very sad. They say that you're dead like mother, but I'm going to put this note in a bottle and throw it into the river because I do not believe them. Living here is very strange. I do not like it. So please come for me if you can. Don't worry, I'm coming for you. Is there anything I can steal off you guys? Wait a minute. No, okay. That'd be funny. Hello, sir. You do not look happy. What are you doing, even? Hmm. Oh god. Well, it doesn't look like you you guys are having a good time right now. What are these things? Are they people? They are people. They're people on like stilts. And there's a whale. Okay. Okay. All right, let's keep going. that down there I don't think I need to blink there but <laughs> blow out the candle yay oh another cutscene the days that follow your trials will be great Corvo alright seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world and at shrines raised in my name these runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this. The heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. Okay. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. Got it. I have a heart now, guys. Equipping the heart in your left hand helps you locate bone charms or ruins, even through walls. The heart beats and lights up when you are facing a bone charm or ruin, and it beats faster as you get closer. The heart will whisper secrets if you press right click while targeting a person or location. This place is the end of all things and the beginning. Alrighty. So it glows when I'm facing it. Alrighty. Well, I guess I didn't need to blink there. <clears throat> Hello. 
I just went silent. I totally spaced out. I just realized. What is over here? Nothing? Alright. Alright, let's drop down, actually. Yay! This is kind of trippy. All of time's meaning is here. Neither seconds, nor centuries. Alrighty. Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to... Alright, how do I... How do I get back up? Oh, I don't get back up. Hey, don't throw me off. Let's get the heart back out. Yay! Oh, I just barely made that. What is this ruin? How do I take it? Do I just have it now? Once you've collected some runes, open the journal and go to the power section to exchange them for powers. Runes can be collected and used to acquire, acquire supernatural powers. Got it. Powers. Dark vision. See in the dark and see level lit. See living beings through walls, including their fields of vision, representations of the sounds that you make are also visible. Hmm. Possession. Allow control of animal targets for a short duration. Bend time. Slow time for short duration. I have one rune, so I can't do that. Oh, okay, so. Uh, three runes. So I can only get this for now. Devouring swarm, okay. Wind blast. Level up this one. Vitality. Increased health. Bloodthirst. Actually, I think I'll level up this one. Thank you. Press right click to see in the dark and to reveal living beings through solid walls. You can also see the fields, their fields of view, as well as visual representation. Oh, yeah, I read this. How you use what I have given you falls upon you as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Alrighty. Now we're back. And now I'm actually waking up for good. It's still there. I still have the power. Look at the sun. Alright, guys. This is actually where I'm going to end this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. Also, comment what I should get next with my runes. And comment what you think of the series so far. And share it with some friends if you enjoyed. You know, your friends might too. And don't forget to, to subscribe to not miss this next episode. And check out my video below. That's my last. Alright, thank you. Peace.